Hey, so I just want to give a life update. Um, so after Warner, I stayed with them for a few months and then I came home, All right? This is how I got home. So I just ended up quitting my job. I didn't have a backup plan. You know, obviously I was just tired of OTR, so it wasn't for me. Um, but I ended up coming home for about three weeks. I did that taxi service lift and then uh, from there, while I was doing that, I was also going to back to CDL school. So I ended up getting my my automatic restriction removed. So now I'm able to drive standard. Anyway, um, so I'm able to drive standard, and then uh, after that, I had uh, applied for jobs, and I ended up getting a job at the plant. Um, but it wasn't really something, it wasn't, it wasn't, it, I wasn't making any kind of money over there. I stayed with them for about a month and a half, still doing lift, you know. And then uh, after that, I ended up applying at this oil field company, and we haul, we haul man lifts, forklifts, fuel cells, which are which is a container, and we go and fill it up for air compressors, light plants. You know, we haul those too. It's a lot of flatbed work. It's a lot of like bumper pull. It's random stuff you know every day could be random like this week i uh i did four loads right and uh they were all plant or light plants and so yeah there i did no strike that it was three loads but there were four light plants on that each on each load and i'd drive out to location and drop them off so i did that and then I'll I'll sometimes go out to random spots and uh, fuel up light plants or you know our equipment basically, man lifts and forklifts. And I do I am capable of driving the 18 wheelers there. So one minute I'll be in the small truck, the next minute I'll hop in the 18 wheeler and back to the small truck truck. Um, a lot of stuff like that, but. It just, it, it, it varies, you know. Sometimes I'm even going out to Dilly, Texas. So, Dilly, so Cuero is, is about 30 minutes away. And Dilly, Texas is about two, two, two hours away. Two and a half, maybe. I don't know, it's one of those. But anyway, sometimes I go out there to our other yard and do it, you know. Uh, unfortunately, I haven't been able to blur out things, and, you know, I kind of want to learn that. Other than that, um, I ended up, I also ended up in a... Uh, a healthy relationship got a wonderful woman cooks cleans you know makes lunches for me so i'm not out there spending crazy stupid you know she uh she even let me move into her house so i'm doing good um right now i'm about to play my ps5 Let's see but yeah i mean is a, this is a wonderful spot she has. It's right down the street from my from my relatives. And yeah, just, I'm here. Um, but I'm more happy than out there uh, driving state to state. You know, uh, I do work for oil, a oil field company. It's like, it's so weird, like, I know I, like, I know I wanted to try oil field, but I didn't think, like, I could get in it without getting in it. Like, I'm in the oil field, but I'm not, like, out there in the heat, you know? I mean, I am, but it's, it's like, in and out sometimes, 
majority of the time, it's bumper pool lights, air compressors, go swap out lights, go move locations, you know. We do haul command centers and RVs and other stuff like that. Um, and I was able to help accommodations where they go out there and set up the house for the wheel food. So, yeah, been able to do that. I mean, there's just, it's, it blows my mind because, like, you don't think about the oil field here in southeast Texas, but there's quite a bit. Like, you, you don't pay no mind to it when you're driving down the road, but everywhere you turn, there's, there's, there's a pad, you know, for some oil field company. To name a few, there's... BPX, Devon, Marathon Oil, you know, and it just amazes me, like, how much oil field there is, like, down here in Southeast Texas, and you never paid attention until, like, they started sending you everywhere that you gotta go for these jobs, but, uh, I would like to show more content, um, unfortunately, I haven't been able to, because, when you're a company, you also get random people out there. You got drivers out there. Uh, you got the actual company people out there. Like it's 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 hard, but uh, I mean, it is what it is, and I still got to figure out how to blur out the company name. So I'll do that sometime. But uh, you know, I learned a lot. And I've only been there since April, and we're in September, so I've been there for a good minute. Yeah, um, tonight I had steak. Uh, last night I had steak too. The night, I can't remember what I had the night before. Oh, I had ribs the night before. Fucking amazing. Um... But yeah, uh, she just went to Dollar General earlier, bought, some, bought little things that we needed. I do hope to show y'all. She's amazing. I love her. I mean, I could uh, go on TikTok and live and whatever. Just don't show the house. <laughs> so, I'm cool with that, you know. For what it's worth. Uh, but yeah, I'm I'm doing exceptionally well. Now, one thing I do want to work on is getting my hazmat, but I've, I've been procrastinating since forever. <laughs> like. Um, and I've been procrastinating on that because like you go in there you got to fill out like four pieces of paper then you got to get thumb printed and then it's take a test and like all I want to do is just get my hazmat. I don't want to do with like the hassle of getting a hazmat but I guess it comes with it you know and then every five years you got to take that I think it's four five one of those numbers you got to retake it but anyway Eventually, I get it. I had a, I, uh, I also did like a little like class online for it, so I got like a little certificate, and you gotta do that now. So apparently that's the thing. I just haven't gone and did it. But yeah. <sighs> that's crazy. It just moves so fast, you know. We actually have been gone, going out of town uh, for a few dates. Uh, we went to the Houston Museum, his, his, uh, Science Museum. Then we went to Corpus to go to the mall there, check it out. And then uh, we went to the Indianola Marina, which I caught a stingray. That was pretty cool. Just 
yeah, I mean, I'm so I got time to go fishing, and I got time to play PS5. I got time for a healthy relationship, and I work. Now my schedule is kind of like it sucks, but it is what it is. <laughs> like when I was with the beer company, I had every weekend off. The schedule it's kind of different. But it's better than OTR where you don't no weekends off. Yeah, except for the one time where I was giving, going home every weekend, you know. But still, I mean, yeah, it's whatever. I like I like sleeping in my in our bed. <laughs> Which that the bed that we bought was brand new, so yeah. Um anyway so the schedule that I have is where I work full week from s- Sunday all to Monday and then I'm off on Tuesday. I work from Wednesday through Friday off on Saturday Sunday. So yeah, it's a little confusing. But it's just from Sunday to Monday. You know? Uh, other than that, I got a pretty late boss, you know? He, like, it's so cool in the oil field where, like, you get this job and they don't ask you, like, hey, what are you doing? Where you at? When are you going to get there? You know, they don't do any of that. They give you the job and you just go about and do your business. Believe me, <laughs> believe me, if they did that for every driver that they had, do you know how much more of a headache it would be? You got 25 different drivers, and you're, and you're asking every single one of them, like, hey, where you at, where you been, you know? Like, I, I couldn't do that. I, I don't even think I can do dispatching, even though I know how to run, like, an actual, like, driver's clock. Because of all my OTR experience, but I don't think I could do that. I don't have the mind. I don't have a business mindset to do that. Other than that, um, I think it's gonna be on the twenty. Oh snap! Today is it? Uh, so today, ten years ago, I lost my mom. So. Sucks. I think uh, I think I'm gonna go by the grave this weekend. See what's up. Yeah. Gotta visit my dad too. Right, right next to her. <sighs> Other than that, I mean, it's pretty amazing. Anyway, um, I'll try to get more content content when I can. Just bear with me. Uh, for now, uh, enjoy the rest of the day. Laters.